Hey, Dexter and I are here at Tacos Los Altos waiting for our friends. We're gonna do a taco challenge. We're starting here. We're gonna see how the tacos are and then we're gonna head over to Santa Cecina. Oh, we found you, sort of. Oh, hey. There he is. What's up, Eli? I already got the camera on your face. Si tienes de ojo, lo de ojo. Let me move over here so you can have a better No, I need people in my videos. It always looks like I don't have any friends. Eloy, you were a great star last time. Oh, yeah. You know the. You know the tripas. Sound like a dumbass. No, you didn't. You know what the medio litro de. You didn't sound like a dumbass. The cathedrals. Yes. They were like thinking, those cannot be his tacos. Mm. Okay, so we've got... What did you get? I have two of tripa, which is tripe, and um, two of cabeza, which is head parts. That's what you put on my but plate. But it's not tongue. No, it's, it's not, not tongue, tongue at all. <laughs> it's like... I maybe should have specified, like, no eyeball. No, it's, There's not, no that. Eyeball it's not that either. It's 100% meat. Yeah, don't worry about it. I wouldn't do that to you. So this is tripe. This one is eye, and this one is uh, just like head. That so one is eyeball. Yeah, that's eyeball. Yeah, but I mean, can you see any eyeball? That's but if you know it's in there, wow. there's less fat in there. I don't know. It's healthier. Yeah. Eyeballs are healthier. Well, we're learning something. Um, <laughs> oh, that just made that up. <laughs> <laughs> Team Taco teaches. And about a month ago or so, I actually had a goat testicle. Oh my god, you guys. And that was, it was actually. It. <laughs> <laughs> they told me to. That's your husband you're talking about. <laughs> but that, it, it didn't taste bad. It just tasted like boiled eggs and it was like egg yeah. yolk. You know, the, the egg yolk, so yeah. it wasn't great, but it wasn't bad. So if you're, that's, maybe that's why Mexicans call them huevos. This is, gonna, this is definitely not going to be a rated G. <laughs> Mel Blossom is never rated G. <laughs> Even if I tried, I couldn't. Right, Dexter, the whole episode would be I, bleep, I enjoy that. Bleep, and I promise bleep. you, it doesn't have anything bad that you wouldn't have. Yeah, nothing, nothing weird. I like how I ordered water and he's just like, yeah, she ordered nothing. Right. Like, <laughs> if they knew what we were doing, right? If you think about it, like, wouldn't you have a hot dog? It's like, imagine what they put in that. Uh, there, you don't even have a clue. Yeah. We gave you the courtesy of knowing what you're eating. You should be thinking. This is part of the head. <laughs> But I'm from Wisconsin, so, you know, if I was from Mexico, I'd just be like, whatever, I'd eat it and ask questions later. <laughs> but in Wisconsin, we don't ask what's in brats or hot dogs. It's not a good a smart. policy. You know, I actually learned to eat uh, salsas here because they were so good that I had to, like, get used to the heat. And I finally... Uh, let's see to take it after many tries. I want my water, I'm afraid. Okay. This is my first bite of this taco. Yum, the yum. face taco. The face taco. <laughs> taco de face. Well, you know, I can see the head. It's to, to, to the side, so you're doing it right. Very good. It's good. Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. It will be able to give Santa Cecina a run for their money, but... I still think. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. We'll <laughs> see. And yours, how are yours? Oh, they were really good. <laughs> They're not dumb. Really good. <laughs> really, really good. Taco Saltos. Okay. 
Yeah. All right, so now we're going to try the chorizo. It's we made the taquitos. So, portion size is a nice good size where you can make two. So is this a piece of um, cheek? Yeah. Some meat, I don't know. Here, Dexter, you want to try some... Like cheek or forehead? Forehead? <laughs> Yummy. Pig cheek. Cow. Oh, cow. Delicious. <laughs> no phone checking, you're on camera. Taco, taco, taco. Yum, yum. I'm gonna make it skinny. I think it's going to be a tough challenge tonight. I'm willing. Are you ready? Yes. <laughs> so for everything, it was 147. Yep. So that was for seven dollars. Seven. So for like nine tacos, two drinks, and a water. A big water was 150 pesos. Yeah. Wow. Amazing. And delicious. It was very good. Mm -hmm. It was very good. I don't know if we're going to be able to have a winner in the taco challenge, really. But We are the winners. We are the winners. <laughs> exactly. You're a winner if you get to come along on the taco <laughs> challenge. Alright, on to the next taco shop. But, tacos and was very good. Hasta luego, gracias. Okay, so where are we? We are in... This is still Turquía. Uh-huh, but like, what's the address of this place? Uh, I don't... The corner of... <laughs> in the corner of... The park. Like where the park is. <laughs> I know, it's, I think it's Boulevard, uh, Universidad, and... Oh, wait, I, maps can find it. I'll do it. I guess I forgot. In this world of technology, I should use it. Like a dress? You know, <laughs> right? <laughs> it's next to some place. <laughs> it's right next to the park. that I actually ordered water. Well, that was funny. The last place was like, you ordered water, so you ordered nothing. That was, that was weird. <laughs> yeah. they, they ran to the store to get it. Yeah. Did they? Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes that happens. This is so colorful. Yeah. So they put french fries on their tacos. Yeah. Interesting. I've never seen that on here. Alright guys. So far, the fries are very good. I never had something like this, but it looks really good. And the salsa was really amazing. It's good. I think we got a contender here. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. Yes. They're, they're like awesome. 
crack. I think they put crack in them. Oh wait, I'm recording. <laughs> you care if I mix everything? They're so good. Because you gotta let them like mix up and get soggy. Yeah. This is a really good one. The food coma sets in. Did you like the no, right. Your commentary. So yeah, the uh, sasina was absolutely delicious. Mm -hmm. The homemade fries were like a perfect topping for it. The cheese was like really good. Like if they like they milk God's <laughs> cattle. <laughs> you know, I just Indian made it cows. from that. Yes. <laughs> Those were absolutely amazing. Damn it. So do we have a winner, ladies and gentlemen? This one said these chickens are really good. They're yeah. the best ones I've had in a restaurant for sure. Yeah. They kill it, man. Yeah. Taco Santos is a different kind of taco. It's, yeah. it's good. It's definitely good. But yeah, but this is different. This is definitely different. It's really good. It's more of a meal, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. But it's really. Well, the items are more quality items. For instance, the uh, chorizo has uh, almonds on it and uh, pine nuts, I think, too. So it's really good. The chorizo? Yeah. Is it here? That's well, you didn't need to order it. Oh, yeah, we got the sasima, but you, you went into the chorizo zone. It was really good. I know. They, I've never had anything here that I've been like, mm, no. Mm -hmm. It's just like awesome and better. Like <laughs> those are the two levels. Even the water. Yeah, they, it fresh. they made fresh agua cebollas. Agua de limón. Agua de cebolla, exactly. <laughs> no, I said sabores. Oh. Agua de sabores. I think I did. Agua yeah. fresca. That's what I said. We're gonna cut that out. I have to cut me speaking Spanish out all the time. Alright, so ding ding ding. Santa Cecina for the win. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> Yay! Santa Cecina for sure. Those, the tacos and La Cruz were good. I don't know, I just like tacos. I'm not really picky, but it was a, it was a fun excuse to go and eat tacos all over the place, right? Yeah. So. It's a great way to see the city too and everything. Yeah, so Santa Cecina wins tonight. Yeah. But the hunt is never ending. And then you gotta find the best tortas. <laughs> yeah. We've got a lot of eating to do. All right, guys. Well, take care. Welcome to Melida. Thanks for taking the taco challenge. Ah, thank, thank you, you for joining us. We loved it. Yeah, it was nice to see you guys again. Oh my God, this is what a taco coma looks like. I ate more tacos and chilaquiles. Chilaquiles. <laughs> I can't say it, but it was delicious. Than I normally eat in like a week of food. So I'm having a food coma. I was thinking about making a t-shirt that said, I'm not fat, I'm pregnant with tequila's baby. But I think I'm gonna have to make one that says, I'm not fat, I'm pregnant with tacos, baby. Oh my God. But yes, my guys at Santa Cecina, we're the champions for tonight. There's plenty of more tacos to eat in this town.